Yeah, rain today. We've got rain tonight and then we might see some snow flurries Saturday night as we cool down over the weekend. So far today we've had about a half an inch of rain here in Grand Rapids. That's the most of anywhere less to the north where the rain took a little bit while to longer to get there. Lots of showers across the area and it's going to rain most of the night. Nice fetch of water coming up off the Gulf of Mexico. That storm system heading right over southern lower Michigan here tonight. So our temperature is likely going to go up a few more degrees and then they'll plummet behind that front later on this weekend. Temperatures are in the mid 40s, 50s down to the south. So I think our temperatures are going to go up just a little bit here later on this evening in Grand Rapids, but so far we're running a little bit cooler than yesterday and will be a lot colder over the upcoming weekend. We'll tell you when the rain will come to an end and when those snow flurries will come and go. And then we're looking at a big warm up next week. You want to stay tuned for that live from the weather deck a little bit later on. Quite the rainy day today. I mean, I, I see George has his rain gear out there. Yes, today he the does, deck. including a clear umbrella where we can see the tree behind you and the drops coming down, George. It's still coming down. <laughs> it still is. How do you know it's not a green umbrella? It could be, but you're not could in front be. of the green screen. You're in front of the tree. How do you know I'm not? I, I know. <laughs> I know. Yes, indeed. It is a wet <laughs> evening out here. I'm in the winter coat because it is a little bit on the cooler side. And yes, the rain is going to continue, but that keeps the fire danger down. 13 weather ball is blinking bright because of the rain in the site. It's also blue tomorrow and over the weekend. We have cooler weather in view. The 13 on your side weather ball sponsored by La Fontaine Ford Grand Rapids. Cloudy rainy day all across West Michigan as predicted and the rain will continue all through much of the night, but end tomorrow morning. You can see nothing but green on the radar. A little bit of yellow here and there. It's just raining a little bit harder in those areas. Back to the south and west, we've got a storm system that is moving up into Illinois. That is going to be moving right over lower Michigan later on this evening. That warm front may get up as far north as Grand Rapids, so our temperatures may actually go up just a little bit before they go down for the rest of the weekend. We're currently at 45, but it's into the 50s down to our south. Here's where the storm system is predicted to be at 7 o'clock. There it goes up over northern Lake Huron on the back edge of that. Yeah, there's some rain and snow showers mixed in up to the north, and that will be tomorrow morning before it moves on out. Then the cold air starts to come on in, so there might be a little bit of light snow flurry activity when you wake up on Sunday morning, but that clears on out and skies actually become sunny during the afternoon. So all of that, if you don't see it in the morning, will be melting as temperatures get back above freezing. Rainfall tonight, on top of what we've had so far, we've had about a half an inch as you saw, maybe another half an inch by tomorrow morning. So all told, we're going to get our inch of rain that we did predict. In terms of snowfall, yes, nothing here between now and Saturday night. That will be courtesy a little bit of Lake Michigan, four tenths of an inch of snow that will likely melt very quickly. So might whiten up those flower beds just for an hour or two here on Sunday. Temperature wise, though, town tomorrow will be down to about 42 for an afternoon high back down to 38, actually below average here on Sunday, but then warming up to 53 on Monday. And boy, is it going to get warm after that. Long range outlook still overall warmer than average temperatures from the 14th through the 18th. Average highs are in the 40s, slightly higher chance for more precipitation as well. So tonight the rain continues 32 to 33 north. No threat of any freezing though, around 35 to 33 down to the south. Low and mid 30s north as well. Rain all night, no threat of freezing. And here in the greater Grand Rapids area, we'll range from 36 to 38 for your overnight lows. 13 on your side forecast. 53 Monday, 63 on Tuesday, and we'll stay in the 60s Wednesday and Thursday. Took the rain out from Tuesday night because really a small chance of that. Another two chances next week, Thursday night and Friday, and then Saturday night and Sunday. We are going to turn cooler. After St. Patrick's Day, highs may, back, may be back down into the 40s during that time period. So, guys, it is definitely a little bit wet out here on the weather deck tonight. <laughs> as soon as you started saying that, we could hear the yes. rain on the rooftop come down a lot faster. Well, let's get you back inside, George. Thank okay. you. <laughs> Love a rainy night. Yes, indeed. It is raining out here on the weather deck. It's been raining most of the day after about 10 o'clock here in Grand Rapids, and it will rain most of the night. 13 weather ball is blue. Cooler weather in view. It's also blinking bright. Yes, we have rain overnight in sight. The 13 on your side weather ball sponsored by La Fontaine Ford Grand Rapids. So walking the dog will be a challenge. I'm going to give you the yellow paw this evening, Janet, for 
Getting Chloe out tonight. 40s though this evening will drop into the upper 30s. Green paw in the morning. Things will have dried out by then, so better tomorrow morning than it will be tonight. Tomorrow, still lots of clouds around. Only 2.2 out of a 10 point scale to create green energy from the sun. Wind will be up a little bit. It'll be more out of the north northwest than it was during the day today. So a little bit of help from the wind tomorrow. Lots of rain out there right now. Everything green across much of lower Michigan right now. All being caused by a low pressure system moving up south of Chicago right now. So it's going to rain for several more hours into the early morning hours as that storm track comes up just to the south of Grand Rapids. So I think our temperatures may actually go up a degree or two before the day is through. Right now we're at 45 here at Grand Rapids. It's 55 down in South Bend with that wind turning around to the south. I think areas south of Grand Rapids will remain or climb into the 50s while we'll stay into the 40s off to the north. There's the storm system at 7 o'clock this evening. By 7 in the morning it's wet all, well over Lake Huron. Maybe a couple of flakes of snow up north, but our rain will have come to an end before the sun comes up and then dry all day. But a little bit of cold air coming over the Great Lakes here on Saturday night may create some light lake effect snow flurries. You may wake up to some flower beds with a little bit of snow on it, but it'll all melt as temperatures get back above freezing as the sun comes out on Sunday. Another half an inch of rain is expected here overnight tonight through about 5 or 6 a.m. Then that's pretty much it. And then we will see perhaps a little bit of snow on the tail end of that on Sunday morning. Looks like we're going to cool off. I, first time in quite a while we have not seen red or orange over the state of Michigan. This is after our 10 day forecast from the 16th through the 22nd. We have just an equal chance of warmer or colder, so that means average highs are likely to be met in the mid 40s for highs. In terms of precipitation, the first time in a while we haven't seen green overhead either. We've had some areas where it has had a higher chance for less precipitation. We're kind of leaning toward that at the end uh, for that seven day period starting March 16th. Tonight, though, no threat of freezing at or above freezing in most areas. Rain most of the night. It should taper off, though, very quickly if it doesn't by daybreak. Up north around 33 along US 10 to as warm as 37 in a Greenville. Your sun coming up tomorrow at 703 and here in the greater Grand Rapids area. Light and variable winds here tonight before they shift to the northwest. Mid and upper 30s for overnight lows. 13 on your side forecast. 38 on Sunday. It'll be breezy with some snow flurries perhaps in the morning before the sun comes out in the afternoon. 53 and sunny on Monday, 63 on Tuesday. I took the rain out from Tuesday night because it's just not going to happen. Dry on Wednesday now and Thursday as we rain in the 60s. Looks like two more rounds for Thursday night into Friday next week and again Saturday night into Sunday. George, if April showers bring May flowers, what do March showers bring? Hmm, I don't know. Uh, four April leaf flowers? clovers. Oh, maybe that's a good one. <laughs> oh, I don't know. The grass will be green enough, that's for sure. Yeah, absolutely, but we still may whiten the grass up a little yes, bit here on may. Sunday morning. Yep. Yeah, everybody's like, what? <laughs> what? Yeah, it is still March. We do get snow in March, but mainly just rain today, and that will continue tonight. 13 weather ball is blinking bright for that inside. It should end very quickly, though. Maybe as soon as daybreak tomorrow. It's also blue. We have a cooler weekend in view. The 13 on your side weather ball sponsored by La Fontaine Ford Grand Rapids. Highs today uh, so far haven't achieved what we thought they would. It's still 45 here in Grand Rapids, 50s down to the south. We thought we'd make at least 50 plus here in GR. So right now uh, we have had another miss two in a row. Hopefully get back on track tomorrow unless we get up into the 50s here this evening, which is possible. All the rain came up out of the Gulf of Mexico. You can think that jet stream coming up from the south, dragging that up into lower Michigan. That's quickly racing to the east. Notice the winds turn to the north later on tomorrow and that will continue through the weekend. So we got a couple of colder days, a little closer to our average highs in the low 40s tomorrow and maybe even colder than average on Sunday. Enough cold air may trigger some light snow showers off of Lake Michigan, but see how quickly the weather pattern changes. We're going to see warmer weather than next week. There might be a little disturbance coming through Tuesday night, but I took the rain out of the forecast, so not much rain next week until late in the week. That's because the winds turned around to the southwest again. So Thursday night, Friday, Saturday night, Sunday might have a chance of some showers. Weather pattern may change, though, after that, as the winds turn around more to the northwest after uh, St. Patrick's Day. As far as our rainfall overnight tonight, we could see up to another two thirds of an inch of rain here in West Michigan before that comes to an end. We also have maybe a little bit of snow in the forecast. This is what our graph model is calling for. 
Uh, generally, just a couple of tenths of an inch, but we are closer to Lake Michigan. Ludington North, you may get a couple of inches, but a lot of this will be melting as it falls. As temperatures will be above freezing during the day on a Sunday, but watch out for a slick spot on the road on Sunday morning. Long range outlook. This is March 23rd through April 5. This comes in every Friday, week three and four temperature. Still northern tier and out west, higher chances for warmer readings. Down to the south, that's where the cooler temperatures will be. And as far as precipitation, we're in an area where we have an equal chance for more or less, most likely rain during that two week period. We usually do get about an inch and a quarter or a little bit less of rainfall. So for tomorrow, if there's any rain around in the morning, that will end and then just some mostly cloudy skies the rest of the day we will jump to around 40 to 43. Northern zones, you'll be around 40 to 41 or so, 43 there in Greenville. Any morning rain will quickly end, mostly cloudy the rest of the day. Similar here in the greater Grand Rapids area. If there's any rain left over, it'll be done very quickly. Highs between about 42 and 45. 13 on your side forecast. Jumping from 38, rather breezy, cold day. Good day to stay indoors and recover from that loss of an hour of sleep. 53 though on Monday, lots of sunshine. Took the rain out Tuesday night, so just mostly cloudy in 63 Tuesday, 61 Wednesday, and still dry in 62 on Thursday until Thursday night into Friday. Two systems coming through. Next weekend, Saturday night rain into Sunday as we cool off back down into the low 40s by the following Monday.